Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Nine of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is an energy of someone who is independent and self-sufficient. Um, you are coming across as, you know, thriving, doing well for yourself. Um, you are appearing to be successful or someone is leading you in this way, and they have so much respect for you. There's someone here who's really holding you in high regard. Okay, so let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Five of Wands in the reverse, Fire Energy, the Hermit, Virgo Energy, and the Six of Cups, Water Energy. So it looks like this is someone you may have taken some time away from. With the Six of Cups, this could be someone you have a history with. You know, this is someone who misses you. This is someone who is thinking a lot about you. And while they are viewing you as thriving and doing well for yourself with that uh, Nine of Pentacles, they are also seeing you as having had withdrawn. You know, like you are spending time on your own or you're more so in solitude, prioritizing your self-care, self-love. You, It's like you're more in an independent energy right now and with the hermit they feel like they haven't seen you in a while and they miss you um this is someone who you could have had conflict with them or they perceive that you may have some sort of conflict with them because you've withdrawn your energy and they they want to make up you know with the five of wands in the reverse they want to be on good terms with you they want to avoid conflict if there is conflict they want to put an end to it this is someone who wants to reconnect with you because they genuinely miss you they love your energy and um you know, there is an emotional attachment here with the Six of Cups. Uh, they are thinking about the good times. They have fond memories and you have a special place in this person's heart. Like you, you, they have a soft spot for you with that Six of Cups. Okay, so let's clarify these cards, Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Four of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So yeah, this is someone who hasn't let go of you. They still hold you, your memory uh, close to them. They, there's this energy with the Four of Pentacles of holding on. You know, uh, they haven't moved on is what we're seeing. So let's see. We have the Seven of Wands, Fire Energy, the Justice card, Libra Energy, and the Ace of Wands fire energy so this person could be approaching you they could be pursuing you they want some sort of new start with you with the ace of wands this person is taking action they're not just gonna sit around missing you um they do want to come towards you and approach you with the seven of wands there's an energy of fighting for the connection fighting for the relationship they have with you uh there could be an exchange of apologies here with the justice card there's a feeling here of wanting to make things right and fair with you um wanting to bring back balance to the connection they want equal give and take um this is someone coming with good energy like there's an honest energy with the justice card being here they they want to be partnered with you and um they are showing up and having that integrous energy with them um so they they may be the ones to make the first move with the ace of wands being here this is someone who's very passionate about you very attracted to you they desire you and they miss your your energy your company um it is more than just physical you know this is someone who, who actually they genuinely care about you it does look like you guys do have a bond and it's been a long time you know this person really does miss you and um yeah they're gonna make some sort of efforts here to to fight for that relationship to be back in, in their life okay so i'm gonna pull out an oracle card for you sagittarius
Okay, so we have it's time to release negativity, full moon in Scorpio. So they really do want to have the new beginning with you and put aside negative energy or any conflicts or drama. This is someone who just really wants to have a better start with you. Okay, so I'm going to plan another card for you. Okay, we have separation time apart from your partner is on the horizon so this could be someone you've been separated from it does look like um you've you've withdrawn you've pulled back there's something about you having uh taken a step back from this connection and you know if there is like a grudge that's being held this person wants to release that negative energy okay so i'm gonna plot another card for you Okay, so we have rebirth and new beginnings. New beginnings are often disguised as painful endings. So it, it looks like time apart has actually made this person value you more. There's something like absence making the heart grow fonder here, wanting that rebirth, that new beginning, and also an energy of them seeing your worth more now. Like this is someone who is recognizing that their life when they when you're not around isn't as great as it is when you are around you know this is someone who is seeing the value of your presence now and they they want to reconnect they want that new beginning with you okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice sagittarius Okay, we have surrender the drama no matter how emotionally charged the situation remain calm and don't contribute to the drama staying centered will help resolve the issue more quickly so there's again that energy of wanting to put some sort of drama behind wanting to make up again um, and this is also an advice to you as well you know if you do want to reconnect with this person there's a need to surrender the drama okay so that's what i'm seeing for you sagittarius I hope you have a really, really good day, Sagittarius. Bye, Sagittarius.